From a student to a business owner, one Hershey eighth grader is taking the skills she's learning in FFA to start her own business making dog treats. As NTV's Lauren Bentley tells us in tonight's Show Us Something Good, she's growing it thanks to a local grant that awarded her $1,000. And I just kind of stood there frozen because I was so shocked. And then I was like telling my friends around me that I just won a grant and they were all excited for me. So I was kind of, it was amazing to win it. After lots of research and hard work, eighth grader Sarah Mund won a national grant to expand her business, Sarah's Canine Kibbles. And two people were chosen from each state and I was one of the people chosen from Nebraska. With the money, she can expand her business that all started in the classroom. Within our program, every student must have a supervised agricultural education exp or experience. So with that, students develop all sorts of SAE projects. I decided to make dog treats for it. And then it kind of all just like I sold dog treats throughout um, the quarter. And then when the quarter got over, my teacher told me that uh, my project was one of the best ones that he's seen, so he thought that I should continue to expand that. She said the idea came from her passion for animals. I love dogs and I love like helping them and making them happy. So, and I like do and I like making the treats. So I decided that I should do that. She makes them at home and sells them across the state. So they're all actually natural ingredients, like human ingredients, like peanut butter and like flour. Well, I sell them to like anyone in Hershey or North Platte, and I've even sold some in Ord, and then I'm going to be going to Lincoln soon, so I'm selling some there. Her business has also shown a different way for students to be involved in ag. A lot of students think that farming is simply cows, plows, and sows, and they don't necessarily think about the other connections to ag um, that isn't necessarily production agriculture. And she's taken what she's learned in the classroom to a business she can run year round. What does that feel as a teacher to be able to see your students succeed like Sarah has? Um, it, it makes me feel very proud, very proud of them and very thankful for the profession that I'm in um, and to be able to see those experiences and those opportunities happening for students. Munt says she looks forward to seeing her business grow and encourages other teens with a passion to pursue it, no matter how young you are. You need to push yourself because it might get hard sometimes, but you need to keep going with it. Showing you something good. I'm Lauren Bentley.